Hello, it's Scott Manley here, and today I have, well, I have a really interesting thing to show you here. Uh, as you may recall, I, at GDC, I bumped into a guy called Dan from Squad that does all the animations from Kerbals, and he explained how I could do this. Yes, uh, Jebediah Kerman's fishing challenge. It's a <laughs> rather interesting little bit here, but uh, yeah, it turns out that the animations for this were inside the game, because... You know, developers, some developers have more spare time than others. But the idea is that you hold space to cast the line, and I'm casting this into the pond here, and I'm holding shift to pull back, and nothing caught this time. So the fishing pond in front of the administration building is the place, the easiest place to go fishing. The deeper you go, the further from home, the bigger the fish, the harder the fish. And we've got one. Now I need to whack the control keys here. Whack, 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 whack. And try to make make these, keep this fish in here. This is actually really easy here, but it's really hard. And at the same time, yes, I got it. I caught a two kilogram fish. I'm going to be eating dinner as soon as I figure out how to get this fish through my helmet. Anyway, the deeper the water, the harder the fish are. The bigger the fish are, but the harder the fish are. So, uh, if you just go off the coast of the space center, it gets too deep and too hard to fish there. you got to find yourself some fresh water if you want to get slightly bigger fish. I, okay, I'm going to admit, I tried doing the deep sea fishing thing, and it was far too hard for me. So I found myself some fresh water here. Took the gull out, and of course, carefully set it down on the surface here. And uh, as the speed bleeds off, Jebediah Kerman takes a step out and we'll try and climb him onto the roof here. Just very carefully get up there, obviously, and we'll just deploy that. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Okay, that didn't work. So yeah, of course I uh, had to chase after this thing. It was really quite embarrassing, to be honest. Thankfully, you can skip most of that boredom through the magic of time acceleration. Yes, I'm not a terrible person. It will force you to listen to my karaoke as I do this uh, very long walk. Anyway, we're here. We're by the water. And, uh, yeah, Kerbal Sports. Let's try casting this. Obviously, Dan worked very hard to add this into the game here. And throw. Yes. No, pull back. Pull, pull, pull. Back. And we got it. We got it. Try to grab it. Oh, it's he's getting pulled down into the water. Look, you see that? Do you see how there's actually some kinematic feedback in that? So as the, the as he's pulling the fish, right? As I'm holding shift to try and reel in the fish, I'm actually getting pulled down into the water. Oh, come on, this fish can't get away. It's so hard to get it in. Come on. Yes! I got a much bigger and badder fish. Right? <laughs> Okay, so of course you're all wondering, how do you do this? So the, to get this, it's basically hidden inside the game, and the way to get it is you have to edit your save file. So what you're going to do is create a quick save, and then uh, I did one called Fishing. I put the guy behind, I put a Jebediah next to the pool. So now I edit this in Notepad++, which is of course the fastest and bestest way to edit Kerbal save files. Now what you're looking in for in this is the vessel that is Jebediah Kerman. Um, now, even though he is just a person or a Kerbal, he is also a vessel in the save file. So we're looking for it, landed, asteroid, asteroid, Jebediah Kerman. Now down in here somewhere, we have uh, a little section in the part module. So we've got a whole bunch of stuff here. So yeah, we're looking for the section where we can insert custom actions. Actions, there we go. So we have to put in the special uh, code for this, which is hexadecimal. So it's going to be 41, 70, 72, 69, 6C, 20, um, 46, 6F, 6F. 6C, right? So that will basically unlock the custom action. So you save this to the disk, and then when we hold F9 to reload it, we're going to reload the file, and Jebediah Kerman will now have the custom fishing action that was basically is hidden in the game. There we go, start fishing, and we can go fishing and have all sorts of fun. Isn't that fantastic? Well, actually, it's not, it's not the greatest fishing game ever, but 
it does have uh, the benefit of being built into a game that everyone already owns because Kerbal Space Program is awesome. I'm Scott Manley, fish safe. <laughs> <laughs>